Okay, thank you. Um, for anybody that doesn't know me, I'm Mark Nikkilan coming from Elastopoli. It has been a very interesting morning. We had KHS and TFT giving us the ABC on <laughs> CFC and Christina was talking about CNF and now I'm going to <laughs> NFC. <laughs> Just a short recap of what we were talking about last year because uh, where I'm coming from is production technology for making actually the composite material for producing guitars or violin fingerboards and so on. To continue the recap, we can get cellulose fibers, as Christina told us, from any plants, basically. We have resulted in about 40% better mechanical properties in the, in the current flaxwood guitar neck. And what Veo told us is that it also has a better sound. When you're cutting down a tree and taking out the cellulose fibers, which are, you have uh, lignin, you have hemicellulose, and you have cellulose fibers in the structure. This is all good, but when you're trying to, when you warm it up to the temperatures that we need to melt it down, uh, hemicellulose and lignin, they don't really work too good. And to put it very simply, we replace the lignin and the hemicellulose with a blend of polymers that is also acoustically active. And at the same time, we get an NFC that is moldable, which means that we can warm it up and it sort of acts like a butter. You can um, inject some mold it into a mold and give it a form and take it out as a guitar or a guitar neck or what have you, a violin fingerboard. So from the industry's point of view, I guess the big deal is not really the material, but actually the process that it sort of enables. And so we actually build a violin. And referring to what Marina was talking about in the morning, that there is really some short supply on good quality ebony in the world. And <clears throat> the violin that was built by by Rauno, has been played by quite a few accomplished players and really the what they've said about it is just positive. It's It has a good feel to it, it has a good sound and actually as with other NFC products it, it is resistance to humidity so it doesn't change. It is a little bit more wear resistant than ebony itself so it is actually a very simple and a very good product that will be produced.